My hope is over the next 10 to 15 years, this whole segment along here develops more like a campus, a university campus, and that we have main little plazas along the way. Well, Velocity Texas is hoping to be a part of change on San Antonio's east side. The buildings on Houston Street, just east of downtown, will soon be home to entrepreneurial dreams. And earlier this week, there was a ceremonial ice breaking at the site of the old merchant ice and storage facility welcoming Velocity Texas and their first tenant. GMSA 9's Tiffany Huerta has got to talk to the CEO about the company's vision and how they hope to spark change. We believe this innovation district will put us on the map as one of the leading cities in uh, science and technology innovation in the country. Velocity Texas, which is part of the Texas Research and Technology Foundation, is behind an effort of innovation on the east side. They come to us and say, here's my idea, here's my patent protection, um, but I'm a scientist. And so maybe we need to put a CEO with them, but we bring in some business expertise. CEO and President Randy Herrick says their mission is to help companies succeed from day one since opening their doors in 2017. That need has been expressed in their growth. The Texas Research and Technology Foundation purchased the four acre site on the east side of San Antonio. Part of the property will house Velocity Texas. When completed, they estimate 665 jobs added in San Antonio, totaling $78 million in wages and benefits. We will have about 330,000 feet of space at a cost of about $220 million. Besides helping build companies, they also partner with established ones. Its first tenant will be BioBridge Global. The company will lease 21,000 square feet to establish the second phase of its GenCure biomanufacturing program. <laughs> While building companies is their mission, their heart is also in the future of the community. We have a program where we're developing to go into the middle schools on the east side, talk to these kids about taking math, biology, and chemistry, and if you do, I'll have a job for you out of high school. Tiffany Huertas, KSAT 12 News.